you took the internet away from any company, any home, the people, the company, the processes, the growth of a nation would stagnate. Really about half the world has almost no ability to connect to anything. Our mission is to enable affordable internet access for everyone. If you look back 10 years, there was no recognition of the need for communications. It was about malaria tents and water and, and, and health services, which are all super, super important. But foundational underneath them is communications. It's really hard to get coverage into rural areas. I went to Africa and started to connect schools and started to actually connect them to the internet and it was hard and literally running fiber in the ground, literally trenching the fiber and knee deep in the mud. In looking at this problem, the only way to solve it was to zoom out and look at it at a global view. When you load a web page over a geosatellite, your internet access is very slow. It takes 20 seconds, maybe. O3B stands for the other three billion. This is the Earth. O3B satellites are about right here. A geosatellite is somewhere out here. It's a very large difference. Our satellite solution is to provide a system of satellites that circles the Earth, and they are logically interlocked with each other, and they create a coverage footprint on the ground that very slowly moves over the Earth. They talk to that satellite, the next satellite comes and it just hands over to the next satellite. And right now O3B has uh, 12 satellites, and they provide very high-speed internet access directly to telecoms around the world. Looking at what O3B has accomplished, we really decided that we could go one step further. This is not a prop. We do work here, but we're very small. Um, we're a startup. We build the satellites, we build the system, we build every component and every piece of the system, and then we model it. Our satellites are about right there. So when you send a signal from the ground, it goes up to our satellite and back down really fast. The latency, the time to go from the ground to the satellite takes longer. This is 130 milliseconds. The latency then to get to the geosatellite is 800 milliseconds to go up and back. We bring it down to less than 30 milliseconds. Now your internet is snappy, but you need more satellites to provide coverage. This will be the largest individual system of satellites that's been launched. What we've done here is designed a system to be able to bring services directly to end users. We wanted individuals to be able to solve their own problem locally. This is a user terminal. This is an example. You place this user terminal on a school. This talks to the satellite in the sky and then it emits Wi-Fi and 3G out to the surrounding area so that access is available for everybody. We're looking to make it very affordable. Well, I'd like to see a $200 price point on it. The entire system will likely cost between $1.5 and $2 billion. I am and we are sitting on a wave of passion, excitement, and understanding that we can accomplish this goal and mission and that everyone around the world can have equal access to the world's information.